Hey friends, Father Charles with Saul at Luchum. It is September the 11th, 2019, 18 years after the terrorist attacks on 9-11-2001. It strikes me that today marks an entire generation of people who have lived in the shadow of those attacks. Why is it that God lets bad stuff happen? But the short answer, the answer no one wants to admit, is that bad things happen because of sin. You see, it's not that any one person was so wicked that God wanted to punish us all and make the September 11th attacks happen. God never wants something bad to happen to anyone. But sin has consequences, and it's the choices that people make that leads to tough and hard and bad things happening in the world. The good news is that God loves us enough that he sent his son Jesus Christ to redeem us from that sin, to save us and to set us free from it. One of the blessings, and yes, I did say blessings, one of the blessings that came from it was that we, as a people, came together after those attacks. It was tragic. I remember being shattered sitting in the post office of my college, watching the towers get struck and fall on television. But everyone, liberals, conservatives, white people, black people, everyone came together that day as Americans. We came together and we prayed. We asked that God might save us, that God might protect us and defend us. As tough as those attacks were, that is the blessing in it. We started on working on our friendship with God. I pray that on this anniversary of September the 11th, that we might all continue working on that friendship, that we might become better and better friends with Jesus Christ, that we would pray for an end to violence, an end to suffering in the world, that we might start working for it, that we might come together as God's people once again, united in love. Friends, let us pray. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us, for we have grieved you with our sinful nature. Father, we ask that you would bless us in all things, that you would use all things to bring us closer to you, that we might come to know and to love you more fully. We ask this in Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Stay salty, my friends.